I love about my country, Germany. As you all know, I live in Germany and in the previous video, I've stated things that I've experienced as black. Hey, beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be saying the things that I love about Germany and the things that I know that you can't wait to hear about Germany. If you've considered moving to Germany and you want to know these things, this video is for you stay tuned and watch this video because you never may know what i want to say in the video it might be of use to you so why not wait or share this video to that friend that you know that wants to move to germany and you know doesn't really know how it goes so today's video i'm going to be sharing good news good things that i love about germany things that will make you want to live in germany you know things that has made germany one of the best countries around the world so the first thing i would say it's you know a job a job isn't that amazing i know you guys have been dying to hear this you'll be like whoa 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 this is amazing because you know if you've lived in other parts of europe before or you will know that having a job is a blessing and whichever country you want to live in if you really if you you know if you have it in your heart that a job won't be hard for you to find that is a plus it's a plus because without a job you can't fend for your family but without a job you're going to end up in the street so if you're moving to germany one of the things you should never be worried about one of the things you should never be worried about if you consider coming to germany it's a job guys a job like germany you can easily find a job within two weeks the highest i would say that has took someone to find a job people that have known in germany is a month and when i say a month i mean a month is the highest i've seen is it that amazing considering how the population is but is it that amazing it's one of the things that has made me to feel fall in love with germany over and over again knowing that my future is secure knowing that finding a job will never be difficult for me or for you isn't that a plot it's a plus guys believe it or not because you know getting a job is not easy but here in germany if you're ready to work i can you know assure you that getting the job is not a problem i don't know if you know this and this is the reason why i'm making this video to inform you getting a job is never a problem as long as you're willing to work there is always a job the thing that baffles me the most is that with the population i still don't know how they you know manage to keep jobs for everyone everyone you know except you're not ready to work the job is always there it doesn't matter and they have different uh companies that can also help you to get a job you know if you're looking for a job and you can't really go because of the language and all that they have different companies that can really you know help you to get a job as soon as possible when i say as soon as possible i mean asp so in that aspect it should be a plus it should be like a hundred plus because to get a job is not easy and if you can easily get a job your life can be easier you can pay your bills and you can be a boss of your own and that is one of the things that germany can offer to you in a platter trust me guys i, I ain't lying my fellow jammers will say that I will see you guys in the comment section below. So if you consider moving to Germany, Germany is the right place. You don't have to be worried about looking for a job because there is jobs opportunity everywhere except you don't want to work. I mean it sis, I mean it bro. It's true, it's true, it's true. I've lived here for years now so I know what I'm talking about. There can be other things but getting a job is not one of them. And when I say getting a job, you know, there is, you know, maybe you, you are afraid, you feel like maybe am I going to encounter racism, you know, are they going to give me the job considering, you know, where I'm coming from, if I'm from Africa or if I'm from every other uh, country, any other country. One thing I will tell you that the Jamas never raises someone when it comes to a job and I'm not lying. I've never had such experience that the Jamas raises you because you're looking for a job or they don't give you this job and this job is available or because you're not a Jaman, they'll say, no, we can't give you this job. I've never heard it. No one has ever told me anything like that. With my experience, my years being here and experience with friends and family, 
the jammers aren't like that if you're ready to work the you are good for the job they are giving you this job it doesn't matter where you're coming from it doesn't matter who you are as long as you have experience and one thing that i love the jammers with even if you don't have experience they are ready and willing to give you this job to always give you a try you know to always make sure that you can try to to do it they always want to give you a chance as long as it has to do with a job they want to give you a chance they want to say if you can do this and if you cannot they can also you know they won't really blame you like oh you spoiled something they'll be like okay i feel like you should try another job and they are not going to you know like tarnish your name and be like no this person is not good no they'll be like maybe there is something else you're good at so that's why in germany there is something called us be done you can also which is something that you know it amazed me you can also learn a job here in germany it doesn't matter your age it's called us be done it doesn't matter your age or where you're from if you're ready to learn then you can learn any job of your choice if you don't have any experience at all with any other jobs then this Germans are ready to give you this opportunity. They are ready to be there for you. They are ready to, you know, they always, you know, one thing about German is like, is that they, they want you to, they want to be the one to teach you something. They want to be the one to start up your first step with them. So they are always willing to learn. They are always willing to teach you. So that is one of the things I love about Germany. So I hope you find this information useful because I feel happy sharing it with you guys as you all can see. The second thing I love is food. <laughs> As you all know, I don't play with my food at all. I love my food anytime, any day. Germany is not a country that you will come to and you will be hungry. It's not possible. When I say it's not possible, it's not possible. If you don't have a job yet, there is, you know, opportunities that they can provide for you until you get one. Even if, see, I know a lot of people feel like, oh, it's just for the African people, it's just for the migrants. No, I have Italian friends, Poland friends who came to Germany as well, who, you know, didn't get a job. You know, they were provided for before they also got a job. So it doesn't matter where you're from. The German government, the German government are always willing to assist you. This is one thing I love about them. They are always willing to assist you. It doesn't matter where you're coming from. I have friends who have moved from Greece to here to this country and they are willing. The German government, when, uh, when it comes to being supportive, they are. They are supportive. Trust me, they are supportive. They don't want you to go. There might be everything else, but the German will never want you to go hungry. Never. When I say ever, I mean never. The Germans will never wish for anybody to go hungry. There will always be a way for them to provide food for you until you get a job. So even if you are not seeking asylum, when you come to Germany, you don't have to fear because there are some places you can go to and, you know, that will help you until you can be able to get a job and, you know, stand for yourself, provide for yourself. So this is the other thing that I will say. The supermarkets, oh my god, the food stuff there are cheap. You know, in the supermarket, there are different types of supermarket. My I have four favorite type of you know supermarkets here in Germany. My first favorite type is Kaufland, the other one is Riamak, and the other one is Rive, and the last one is Neto. And Neto is my best out of all of this because Neto they have cheaper things. When I, oh, don't laugh at me, guys. Don't laugh. I'm just stating the fact, okay? Neto have cheaper things, cheaper stuff, you know? It, and it's not like because they have cheaper things, their things are not good. Their things are perfect. Their things are okay. See, you can get something that you can get from Ria. You can get it from... As for me, there are different things that I love to get from each supermarket. I can like to get my rice from Coughland, and I like to get my milk from Neto, and I like to get my meat from River because they always have fresh meat, and I like to get my other stuff from Ria. So this is how it is for me, and I would say their food are always cheap. With S5, you can as well like prepare a full rice and chicken and sauce with Aero 5. You can prepare this. So food is cheap here in germany food is cheap food is cheap it's cheap it's cheap it's cheap i keep saying it you can't go hungry if you have s10 or s5 you can cook something
so you can cook something with such amount of money isn't that amazing of course it is so i have provided two important steps which is important if you want to move into any country work and food the boats here are one of the things that i love about germany the third one is cool the school opportunity oh my god guys the school, like you can literally have your child today and have this child ready start. That is so amazing. Like it's, it's easy of the job. Like when I had my last child, immediately I had a child. Before even going to the school, I already got a letter from the start that we are welcoming your baby to the, uh, to the start. You can go to such schools. They sent me later with, you know, with crash already. With, here in Germany, we call it kindergarten. So they already sent me letters with crash, which is kindergarten here in Germany. They sent me letters of like three kindergarten that is very, very close to me. And they're like, you can pick from this kindergarten. And the best thing is that they sent me a bag and my son still have the bag thing today. The bag is so cute. It's a green bag. It was a badge of um, this particular state that I lived in. And the quality was amazing. They sent me some other stuff like flowers. When I just gave birth, I came home. I met the stuff a week after I gave birth. And I was like, wow, they even know that I have a baby. That was amazing. You know, I felt somehow, I felt blessed. I felt like having a baby over and over again. <laughs> so yes, they sent me this. The school system is nice. They sent me this. So I had to, they made it very easy for me that I can choose from the two replaces and then I can call those two replaces and tell them, okay, I have a child of so, so, so uh, age where I just gave birth to this child a few weeks ago. I will want this child to be coming to school uh, next year. So I want you guys to, you know, create a space for this child, which is amazing, you know. And one thing I love about the Jamas is it do, as in, they can give you an appointment of one year and you'll be like, they are giving me an appointment of, of appointment of one year. How do I even recall? How do I remember? When it's like two months to that exactly of your appointment, they are going to send you letters. One month to, they are going to send you another reminder to remind you. And I don't even know how they are able to remember after a year long, you know, but they still remember and they still send you a letter and tell you that, okay, you know, you you have to so appoint me so so date this is what it is this is what it is this is, this is one of the things i love about it because sometimes i'm i might have forgotten that i applied for a school place for my child and then i got a letter that okay the place you apply for your child it's available can you bring your child and if it's not available then we also reply earlier much more earlier so that you can you know look for another place you know call another school look for another opportunities for for your child so one of the things I love is that this school, you can as just, as, you know, as early as having your child, you can tell them that my child is born. So I want my child to be at school at age one. And then they are going to state it down and create a space. So these are the three important things that I feel like to me as a parent, as an adult, it's very, very important to me. And these are the things that I consider important and JAMAs are best at it. They are best at it and I consider it important. I feel like, why don't share it with you guys? If you've been worried, you'll be like, how's Germany like? I hope these tips, you know, this very important step that I've shared with you, I hope it helps because there is not a, like a, a country that you can get a job anytime, any day, like ASP. And there is no, nothing like a country that you can get food. And there is nothing like a country that you can, your, you or your child can get a good education system, a perfect education system. Like, it, it, it's so good that they, they give your child chance, they create a chance for your child to learn, they create a chance for, for your child. And the, the Germans are, are slow with their kids. They are, when I say slow, I don't mean it in the bad things. I mean they are patient. Yes, that's the right word. They are patient with these kids at school. I've had experience with my kids who are at school or at kindergarten. They are, they are patient. They, they, they do what's best for these kids. They do what is best for the kids. They, they want to see the kids grow. They stand for them to, to the extent that the kids are, you know, well enough to be on their home. So these are the three important steps that 
I wanted to share with you guys. I hope this video helps. The first one is the job, the second is the food, and the third one is the education assistant. <laughs> I can keep going on and on and on and on, but these are just the three important parts that I feel like they are very important and I wanted to share with you guys. I hope you guys like this video. So if you're coming to Germany, you are free, you are welcome to come to Germany. Germany is actually a welcoming place to be. There are qualities that they are very good at and they don't mess with these qualities. They don't, you know, miss these qualities. These qualities, they are good at it and that is it. So guys, like every country, there is good and bad. But this stuff that I just said here right now in this video, they are all truth, they are all fat, and it is real. Okay, it is real 100% five star given to me by given by me and many many others. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and this little chit chat. I had fun making this video, you know, pouring it out to you. You know, I feel like I'm actually, you know, explaining to someone who actually needs it out there. See you guys in my next video. I love you all. Bye, your sister, your girl, one with Christ. See you guys in my next video. Bye.